Hi guys, this is Jiggy, a portrait and wedding photographer from the Philippines and welcome to the channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I can create three very quick, simple layouts using this LED lights. So the lights that I'm using are two M200Rs from Photix and an M180 from Photix. The background that I'll be using today is another one from Kate Backdrops. This actually isn't a backdrop, but rather it's a flooring, but I decide to use it as a backdrop. The camera that I will be using will be my Sony A7R Mark III and the lens will be the 70-200 2.8 GM. So let's start shooting! So I had to weaken most of the ambient light because they would be interfering with the light that's coming from my small LEDs. Now, I have both M200s here and I created a clamp-shaped lighting otherwise known as your standard beauty light. The M180 is here in the back to create a nice background light. Now, why do I always start with a beauty light? Because generally, it means what it says. It is a beauty light. So no matter who you put in front of lighting like this, they will always look beautiful. So this is a good piece of advice, especially for a lot of beginner photographers, is that when you are shooting non-models, it's best to start off with your go-to light, such as this one, so that the moment that you take their picture and you show them the image that you've taken, they will be more motivated because they are gonna be happy with the picture that they will see, okay? So I guess it's time for, for me to call in my wife. Babe, do you mind? So let's turn on our background light. All three lights are actually set at 5600 Kelvin so that I can set my camera also at 5600 Kelvin. Turn this one on. So that one's at 50%, the M180. This one is at 40%, and this one's at 100%. So with this type of power, none of these existing ambient light will be affecting the image. Hmm, okay. So my camera settings. As you can see, my white balance is at 5,600 Kelvin, which is the, the color temperature of my light. I am on manual mode now, but my ISO is set to auto. So in other words, I can control my shutter speed and my ISO will adjust accordingly. I actually don't like the top light. I think it needs to be a bit stronger. So here, there, the position's a bit off. All right, perfect. 40%, 100%, beautiful. Maybe I'll overexpose it, I'll put it there. Proper exposure, beautiful, lovely. Babe, how about giving me your right shoulder? Okay, then chin towards me. Then look straight towards the camera. More of your shoulder, please, good. Love it. Chin towards me a bit more, but shoulder this way. Yeah, then chin towards me. Good, some more. Good, there we go. Very nice, beautiful babe, very, very beautiful. One last, very nice. Okay, so once you've gotten this type of light down, you can now start shifting. Now, let's take out this background light, okay? We won't be needing that anymore. We'll just need two lights. I'll shift this one now to this way. This one's still at 100%. Oops, sorry. Put this one in the back, and this one will serve as my background light, and at the same time, as a hair light here, and eliminate this part here. Now, with this particular light, I'm gonna shift it to horizontal, to vertical mode. This M200 has attachments for both vertical and horizontal, meaning screw points for vertical and horizontal. I want this vertical because I want to create a, an edge here photo this time. Let's put this, excuse me, somewhere here. All right, I think this one's okay. And the pose, let us get something for Coco to stand on, uh, to put her foot on, maybe can you put your right foot here? Perfect. Okay, this time I think I need to move back. Beautiful. Now, I think I'm going to increase the power of this light, maybe to 70% now. Then I will expose for here. 
and that will weaken the background light also. So can you look there, babe? So now I'm going to underexpose a bit. There, beautiful. Lovely. Chin down, please. Cool. Lunge forward. It's a lean forward. Yes. Then twist your uh, look there to your left. There. Perfect. Chin down. Good. Um, shoulder. Can we do something with your shoulder so that it's not too straight on towards the camera? Yes. So this foot, put it go towards here. Yeah. There. So your left shoulder, bring it down. Yeah. Then look there. Perfect. That's it. Let some more. Hold that pose. Hold that. Now I'm going to twist, shift the light a little bit more so I can see that part of her face there. Beautiful. That's one thing I like about working with, with continuous light. I can see everything that's happening. Chin towards her a bit more. Good. I love that. You know what? It would be cool if I bring it up, then tilt it down. Yeah, there. Very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, that's actually one layout. That's a second layout. But since I, I mentioned earlier, the M200Rs are actually RGB lights. So with a click of a button, I, I can immediately change the color. So making this purple, making this blue, gives you an entirely different look to the scene. Can we have the same pose, please? There, cool. There, perfect. Yeah, give more angst to the shoulder. That's, that's perfect. That's all right. Then look there. Good, part your mouth a bit. Your fingers, make it more, yeah. There, that's perfect, that's perfect. Love that. Ooh, love it. Love that. One more. And then look there, some more. Some more. Good. Tilt your head away from camera, please. Good, chin down. Good. I love it. Actually, I'm seeing something now. Just one quick. Oh, no, it's okay. Normally, normally I'd be running around, but since I am recording, I want to I want to show you guys what it is that I'm actually seeing. That's why this is on a tripod. But normally I would be doing this and this. But yeah, but since the layout is good, good, I like that. Beautiful. I hope you guys don't mind. For this final layout, I'm gonna do this. Yeah. Handheld now. Very nice. Good. One more. Love it. Now look at me straight. Good. Look at me. Let's bring in more of that light. Shoot you from below. Tilt your head towards your right. No, your right. There. Good. Looking out. Good. Love it. And then final, keep that. Tilt your head away, please. There, perfect. Beautiful. That's it. All right, sorry. That is heavy because I have so many things attached to this camera. But yeah, so. Three simple quick layouts with just LED lights that actually fit inside your pocket. So that's how small it is. It's as big as your cell phone. That's why I keep three of them inside my bag all the time, just in case I want to do shots like this quickly. So hi guys, when I was doing the edits of the video that you just saw, it dawned on me that maybe I should message Photix Philippines and ask if they could give a promo for those people that actually watched until the end of this video. And fortunately, they said yes. So they are basically offering a 20% discount on the M200R and the M180. So all you have to do is go to the Facebook page of Photix Philippines, send them a direct message, 
and in that message put in the promo code that I placed somewhere in the middle of the video and that will automatically make you avail of the 20% discount. Now this promo is going to run from the time that I upload this video up until August 18, 2020, 10 p.m. Philippine Standard Time. Now, unfortunately, this promo might just be applicable to those people residing here in the Philippines because of shipping concerns, but rest assured that I am in touch with Fotix International, and eventually in some of my future videos, we will be able to offer a promo such as this to all their international customers. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please do subscribe to the channel, and while you're at it, click that notification bell so that, you're get, so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you want to see more of my images, you can find me on Instagram. It's at Jiggy Alejandrino. Okay, till the next video.